So I'm going to start Photoshop. This is my UV map. This is where I'm and where I put the stuff to make it look the way I want to is going to go inside the shelves. Now, I'm going to photo source this. I'm not going to try to do this by hand. But I'm also just not going to do kind of a direct rip. So let's say I want this to be wood. So let's let's find some wood. I may want slats, or I may want just kind of a solid piece of um, um, what's the word? Um, particle board, like this one. Or I might want something a little bit sturdy, a little bit more original. Let's let's go with this one because I just find it to be a little bit more interesting. And that's medium. This one. is made from a couple different pieces or one big piece. This is probably too big, too small for it to be you know, made out of you know, one big piece. So I'm going to take this so it looks like it's actually stable but they may not have that if not then it's just not going to be able to do what I want to do
so I can draw, do this, and I'm probably just going to create a mask right here.
put like a little sign on here. like this print up on here. So what I'm gonna do I'm going to open with Photoshop and what I'm gonna do is I am going to one and I'm going to do a magic wand not a magic wand let's do a quick selection. There I'm gonna inverse this
that's going to show is stuff that's within the UV map. Anything outside of it is not going to show. But when I'm ready for it, I'm going to hide it. Um, save as. Now, I save my PSDs because I don't know if I'm ever going to need them again. And I always have something to go back and make corrections. So I'm going to save this. I know that is mapping across this and it 